DJ Cooper was thrust into the starting role as a true freshman and was a part of the team that dismantled the Goliath Georgetown in the NCAA tournament. Cooper did not just have his feet to the fire in year one, he did it in the dark, without an older player serving as his role model. It's kind of 50-50, you know, uh, you know, me by me doing that helped me grow up quicker, you know, and, uh, but you know, as well, I would like somebody else you know, to be there that could help me out a little bit. Fast forward two years. Cooper is now a veteran leader of this Bobcats team, while Stevie Taylor is the newcomer. But it's a change DJ has embraced. Uh, that's a big difference, you know, uh, you know, you have more responsibility, you know, you have to, uh, you know, you have to, you know, just be more careful, be more disciplined, you know, and uh, make sure you lead an example. But it's not just leading by example. After starting for almost three years, Cooper has plenty of wisdom to pass on to his freshman apprentice. Just keep confidence, you know, uh, when you have a bad game or two, you know, don't don't get down on yourself, you know, just keep playing and, uh, you know, try and just be a, a leader to him. But, uh, you know, sometimes just stay on about practicing hard every day, you know, make sure, you know, you bring your, your game habits to practice as well. Just slowing down, running the offense, and uh, vision, having court vision out there. And while Cooper has given Stevie advice, the freshman has taken lessons away from his mentor's actions. He's, he's, he's a competitor. You know, that's why I look, look uh, that inspires me to play hard every day. I can only get better by listening to him. But as is the case with most big brother, little brother relationships, the little guy can always find a way to agitate the older one. And I'd also say, like, he cannot beat me at a FIFA. He is not better than me. He thinks he's better than me. I'm actually his big brother in FIFA. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs>